Hey guys, it's Fozzy here, and welcome back to another video in my terraforming world, which is great because it's so fun. And today is a very special episode, which I'm going to be doing every month, at the end of every month, I mean, um, of everything that I've done this month in building. So this is what I've done this month. Um, I have, starting at episode one, I built this little central area to start us off with the cool lights that light up every time you go near them I, I'm still not over this I'm still, I just I can't believe that I actually came up with this in my head and it worked I'm surprised and then over here is the farming area with the corn and the carrots and the corn the potatoes and the wheat and I'm yet to build half of these farms but it's fine it's fine and the pathway comes down here or you can go around this way I suppose like a little circle, like a little roundabout. Okay, and then you get here, and there's a little pond, some lily pads, and you can sit down, sit down, and just enjoy the view of my face. Hello, you're very close to me right now. <laughs> or you could enjoy this bench, I suppose, if you felt like going across the water. Just enjoy the view. The big, actually, that's quite a nice view. There we go screenshot of it. So the lily pads and the water flowing and the lights. I'm still surprised. Now you can choose to go up here in which you could see everything else I built and then you can pretend to go in here but there's not really anything in here. This is what it looks like inside all of my houses. I cover it in black concrete so that you think it, it has something in it. It doesn't actually have anything in it come down here and this is hollow <laughs> everything here is, is just a ruby and you can choose to go through the house it kind of feels Alice in Wonderlandy but it's there with a bit I love this bridge it's brilliant and you can come down here with the wheelbarrows and the flower fields and the little buzzy bees and um, just come here next to the carrot farm up there, which I feel like I need to put more bushes around here because that's very, very open. But I'll do that later. I'll do that later after I finish recording. Oh, I just need to fly. You can come through here. And you may or may not have noticed there is a door here. It's the door. Um, this is where I write down all the things that I need to do. I've done that. I've done that. And these are the these are the things that are coming. So yeah. That is an actual room. The only room in the entire world, but it's a room. And then you can come up here and here is the duck pond. So you can see the barrier blocks now. <laughs> they are there. Um we can come down here to the windmill with the buzzy bees that should be out but aren't. No idea where they are. Maybe they're inside. You can see the llama. And if you come over this way, there's a subtle little thing. Which is a tiny little pond. Drip leaves and stuff that comes from the picnic area up there. Which is always fun. And then we'll go back through the field and I'll show you the windmill up close and personal. This is the windmill. Again, blocked off. But it's the windmill. Um very cool, got a barrel in the middle of it. I was quite proud of my little windmill things. What are they called? Sails. Are they sails? I don't know. And then some... Hello! It's just a goose with an egg. <laughs> I love that. Um, you need to step away. Yep, there we go. Here's the, here's the duck pond. Should we try hatch some ducks? Three eggs, right? No. Four, five. Five eggs. Okay. We're gonna try five goes, okay? One, two, three, four, five. Nope. Okay. Gods weren't happy with us today. That is an empty flower pot. Let's fix that. Where's the flower? fix this. There we go. All fixed. And then you're shoving me. 
Hi. Ducks on stools. It's the best. It's the best place to be. And the nests and it's all good. Go through here. Oh, hello, butterfly. And then here is the stables and the lava ranch up there. And this way, the carrot farm. But when I tell you that this is like two blocks thick, I did mean that it was actually two blocks thick. <laughs> um, <laughs> literally two blocks thick. Um, if I break this wall here, that's the door. Yeah. It's, it's thin. It's a thin wall. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, you are a scary duck. Why do you look like that? I'm concerned. And then, down this pathway, if I take a sharp left, the little teddy bear's picnic. And then you've got the little pond with the with the candle. And the and the yeah, the little waterfall, mini waterfall. And you've got this path along here that goes to the stables. And I don't know if I Hello. <laughs> Who are you? You sell these things. Oh my god. Hold on. Hold on. I need to get all these things. Wait. in the chests. Pop these in here. And I will use them later. But for now, they're there. I will most likely forget about them. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, back to the top. Okay, here we are. Here's the names. This one's Tiddles. Tiddles the bony horse. Mr. Wigglesworth the 24th, the horse. Tim Tom, the zombie horse. John, the mule. Patrick, the donkey. And this is Cat the Cat. Who I'm going to give a, a green collar to. Beautiful. Uh, let's go. And a dog that has managed to get in here somehow. And this is the llama pen. This is the llama. Do you like my llama statue? I copied it off of a Pinterest thing. I love it. And this is my llamas who don't actually have names. So if you want to name a llama, you can name a llama. If you want to be a llama, just tell me your name and I'll make you a llama. Just tell me which one as well. Um, then this little corridor, which I love so much, is beautiful. You come up here, and you can see straight into the lava bed. It's beautiful. And you can see across the entire world. It's beautiful. I love it. And you come up here, and this is a big empty space. Why is there llamas up here? I think these are the traders' llamas. <laughs> wow. Okay. Well, now I have escaped llamas as well as dogs. It's fine. And up here, I don't know what I'm going to put up here. So, if you have any ideas, just tell me. Just let me know. I'll put something up here. And now that is that is the um, the January tour of of the world. Let's go up. Let's fly up. And see how much we've done. Should we make a map? I'm gonna make a map. <laughs> Can I make a map? Let's make a map. Where would I put the map? Let's work this out. Let's put it up here.
Okay, so I've put the put the map up here. I've locked it with the cartography table. And this is what it looks like so far. This is what the world looked like from above. The windmill, the duck pond, it's the starting area, it's the house, um, the carrot field, the bees, the stables, the big empty area that I've got left out for that. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Just, just give me a second. Just, just a second. Just a sneaky little sneak. Just a map. Back to the. And that's the llama field. And that's the big empty space that I've left. That's the, that's the teddy bear's picnic right there. And the little pond and the big fields. Oh, this is looking quite good actually. I'm quite proud of it. Very proud of it. And this will become the map room. Let's, let's spruce it up a little bit. This is a very sad map room. That's our little map room with our January map here, probably the February map here. So I'm going to carry on working on this area, hmm. and then I don't know what's going to go on. Oh, this is going to be fun, beautiful. My little tiny custom tree, which isn't all that great, but it's there. I want to change these up for walls. Let's try and inside. Diorite. It looks kind of better. Should I add some, maybe? Hmm. I don't know. I'll work on that. I'll work on that later. That is the tour. Oh, no, that's a screenshot. So that is the tour of this world for now. I hope you tune in to next month's videos because they're gonna be pretty cool. As you've seen what's coming on the little the little signs so far. Um there's also more ideas. I have a Pinterest board for, so I'm very excited. And I hope you tune in next month to see all the cool things. If you liked this video, or liked everything in this video, please subscribe, drop a like, leave a comment what you want me to call my llamas, because my llamas are cool and they don't have names, and that's unfortunate. So, I will see you all later. Bye bye! Brilliant. Okay, great. Blah, blah, blah. Oh.